Today I'm working on a Hitachi TV and the problem was it wouldn't turn on and when it did it only had some of the picture. Well, you notice if you got your TV taken apart by now you notice the power supply board is missing and you'll notice one of the inverter boards is missing. And you want to do a little scan of your inverter boards and you'll see that there will be a burnt chip. And that's just flux. I tried taking the chip off and I couldn't get it off. It had to, to heat it up from the bottom and all that so I just said screw it. Ordered a new one off of eBay. I'll probably throw that one back up there. On the power supply, there's two capacitors. These guys right here. This guy was still good, so I left him. This one is just 3300 microfarad, 100 volt. It's, it's got a roundness to it. I wish you can hear it, but if you shake it, You might be able to hear that clicking. That's the actual stuff inside the capacitor. It's dried out. Which caused that chip to blow. So, if you only have partial, this, this would be what this ribbon's for. If you only have like partial screen, then you know you got a chip burned out. Possibly you need to have capacitor changed out. So what I'm going to do now I'm going to put this all back together and show you that it works. Alright, see what happens. Blue lights on, HDMI across the screen. Sweet, nothing blew up. In sync signal, no sync signal. Cool, TV works. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Make sure you subscribe and leave me a comment if this fixes your, your TV.